Wait, you're next, right? Good. Let's get right about here, right? Good. Good. So if you, so if I go for this and you do that, or if I go for this and you do this, it still works. They're kind of interchangeable. Okay. Both of those moves are Floyd Mayweather's kind of like his signature moves. Where he goes like one, two, pull two, or one, two, shoulder two. Okay. He's kind of uses both. Yep. He's famous for it. He has a Philly shell, which he fights like this. He wasn't the first to do it, but he was the most successful to implement that style. Get one, two, sit the bell. Ready? Good job. Good job. Be blessed. Be blessed. Ready? How you feel? Good. Good. Good job. Yep. Keep on. Keep on. Nice and relaxed. Good. I have to throw overhand try to throw straight to back, right? There it is. Yeah. Doesn't feel like you get much power when you throw it like this, but believe me, if you do it properly, you do. Everyone thinks they get more power going like this before they throw it. That just tells the guy what you're doing. Right. Tell him the yep. yeah. Good. Once in a while, I'll notice you throw your two, and you then after you throw, throw it straight, but it'll fall down like fall this. Down. Bring it back to the same path. It gets, it gets home sooner, so you can use it again, and you're protected. Yep, right there. Good. You're a fast learner, man. We only worked about three rounds. You remember all this? <laughs> Get it? Yeah, yeah. Good job, good job. Now, if I could get you to go over there and pick out a pair of spots. So, we're going to want to stay right about here. Just a circle right about here. Ready? Now, get in your stance. Hit me with a jab right here. Harder. Harder. How would you hit somebody in the fight? Like that. She hit me with the right hand. Harder. Good. No. That's so hard I want you to hit me. I'm not always going to let you hit me. I'm going to eventually take it away and make you work for it. Yep, just float. Have fun. Throw whatever you can think of. Yep, try to be fast. Good. Yep. Good. Yep, try to get close. Instead of aiming at the target sometimes, sometimes aim a little further past it. That way, if I take, if I step back, you'll still get me. Yeah. I meant basically punch through the target, not just at it. Especially with this hand. Yeah. So watch, I'll demonstrate. Boom, boom. Through the target sometimes. Yeah. 
<laughs> yep, but ball hitting me, I'm saying. Yeah, but there still has to have that snap back. You're just, you're guessing, you're, you're pretending the target is further away than what it is. Yep, that's it right there. Good. Keep breathing, keep breathing. Good job, good job. Right there. So the only time it's not really cool to lean back in boxing, lean back. You have nowhere to go but further back. The pull is a different story. You're literally snapping back here. Small. Yeah, very small snapping. Good. Good, snap that jab. Good. Good. Keep pumping your jab. That's your most used punch. This is your measuring tool. It's your point getter. It does a lot of jobs. You gotta win. You gotta win the round on points. Knockouts aren't that common in amateur. Snap it, snap it, quick. Yeah, good. Keep throwing. Where's your right hand? Harder, right, snap, faster, snap it. That's the one. Yeah. Try to get progressively closer through your combination. Like, watch, I'm going to get... <laughs> See that? I'm getting closer as I punch. Good. Good. We'll record one more. I know it's gotta get how you feel, good? Good. Good. Snap it, snap it, snap it. Yep. Snap. Yeah, the bring back is more important than the part A. Good. Good combo. Good. Good. Put them together. Sometimes you might have to throw five to land one. Good. Make your one and two like one thing. Like. <coughs> That's the one right there. Good combo, good combo. Keep throwing. Good job. 